guys, Mason here, and welcome to day 13 of my vlog series, Explore Me Side by Train. So, to get this already started, I'm already at Lime Street, because we're going to catch this northern service to Highton, because today we are going to Prescott, Eccleston Park, Fat O'Keefe, St Helens Central, and Garswood. So, we're going to hop on this now, and then I will see you at Highton, probably. Right, let's go there now. <laughs> So I made it to Highton now. I have highlighted this back in, I think it's day 10. I'll put it up on screen what day it was, because I honestly can't remember. Um, but yeah, I've already ticked this off. <coughs> Ooh, <pain. coughs> so we're going to wait 10 minutes for the Wigan Northwestern service. And we're going to go one stop to our first stop today, Prescott. <laughs> so it's quite windy and a bit gloomy today but hopefully the weather might change so yeah right we'll wait for our we're gonna offer some trade to prescott my phone fell off the tripod remember this having you right when it's on there it fell face first this time it just fell off the tripod like the tripod didn't like hold it oh yeah we're going on our train now three three one one oh one it's been a while since we've done that so Let's get on this now, one stop to Prescott. This is Prescott. Okay, so I've got our 331-101, I'm now at our first stop finally, Prescott. So Prescott has two platforms and sees northern trains only. So, this station has a lot of Shakespeare, and I'm not a fan of Shakespeare. <laughs> so, get me away from this station. <laughs> um, but yeah, it has a footbridge, dot matrix. All that sort. Oh, the, yeah, the signs are quite different here. I can just show you right now. This one. Oh, they're all high up as well. Shakespeare. No. <laughs> Get Shakespeare off there. But the Maisie Bell is like in the top left corner. Anyway, instead of like all on the side. Um, oh, no, it's on the top right. It's on the top right, not the top left. Anyway, Shakespeare North Playhouse. Never going there. <laughs> Anyway, so yes, we're at Prescott anyway, that's fine. So, we've got half an hour, what should we do? No idea, but something smells lovely. <laughs> and I want to find it, <laughs> you know, I want to find it. <laughs> to prevent as well the um, tripod incident happening for the third time, I'm just going to use handheld for a bit until like, if my hands get too cold or something and I start shivering. Then I will switch back. But right now you're just going to have to bear with the shakiness. If there is any. As it, well there obviously is because my hands are always very shaky for some reason. But yeah. Anyway I want to find out where that smell is. Whilst we have half an hour anyway. So we might as well do that. So my guess is Prescott is a park and ride station because it literally says P and R up there, which obviously if you're at a station that means park and ride. I mean, like I think the place has been a bit more modernised because these buildings look really new, and so does this building. But the best part is that footbridge, that lift part with the. Maisie Travel and the National Rail sign up there. That's kind of cool. I like that. I like modernised stations like where they do that. Um, I don't know why. It just seems more modernised and nicer. But yeah, I think this 
places being a bit revamped or like it was just in like nowhere or had loads of old buildings or whatever but yeah they've really changed up the this this part of the place so i'm really happy with this With my 10 minutes left here, I have spotted another exit on the other platform on platform 2. So, let's have a look and see what's on that side. Whew. I've been stood at the end of the platform because it's a stand clear. And I was about to take a photo and then just went back to take Liverpool Lime Street. Where is it? <laughs> So, I have crossed the bridge. Oh, this one here as well. Lovely. Um, crossed the bridge, went through the exit or entrance, whatever it is. And um, just following this path. Don't know where it's going. Guess we might find out. If it, if it, if it was a park, which I don't know, it's a big estate here, isn't it? Right. Oh, it's not really anything. It's just a big massive path going all the way down here. But you know what? That is nice. Must admit. Right. Let's get back to the station whilst we can. Um, I know it's still got like time anyway, but yeah, let's get back. <laughs> okay, so I am now getting on the train. The train is... 331 0 I can't see the light uh 031 331 let's get on it to Eccleston Park where I'll be the three fair three coaches. Oh wait no they're all three coaches. Alright let's get on the train. <laughs> Right, I'm now at Eccleston Park. Eccleston Park has two platforms and sees Northern trains. I'm not really liking the station already. Um, ooh, there's a big massive yellow handled path. So, yellow bars, what, what, keep, I don't even know what this is. is it yellow rails, handrails, something like that. Right, we're gonna walk up here. <laughs> Eccleston Park, then. Is there a park? Is there a park? Where's the park of Eccleston Park? Maybe it's down here. To cross to the other side, it's literally, it sells you to go over the footbridge, but then I couldn't see it. But then it's literally just right there. So, let's go. Let's go on. So I'm now down on the other platform. They have an in post here for Eccleston Park. Now this side, on platform one, they have more of a estate area part. But yeah, it's really weird here. It's giving me a feeling of Manchester more than Merseyside, really. They do have one of them old trio ticket um, advertisements as well on screen. Um, but what I'm going to do is I'm going to walk back up to the other platform. I love that circle mirror thing because it reminds me of London Underground when I was there two years ago in July 2022 for um, my birthday in um, the birthday vlog. I don't know if I um, filmed one of them but I it just remembers, it reminds me of them corners on the underground. <laughs> I can hear another 331 <laughs> just arrived into the station now. Imagine it was on our side. <laughs> I don't spend even more here. <laughs> Let's see. It should be for the other side. Because ours is like every half an hour. Yeah, yeah. Oh, that's lovely. Hallelujah, I've 
in here for like 20, 27 minutes and the train's already arriving. <laughs> Thank goodness for that because it's A, getting really cold now and two, it's boring here. <laughs> so yeah, let's say goodbye to Eccleston Park and our next stop is Thatter Heath. So, what's the train we're getting on? It's definitely 331, I can tell you that because it's right there. Right, let's see what this is. Hold on, hold on, hold on. 331. Zero two zero. So three three one zero twenty. Let's get on it. One stop to Sato Heat. Okay, I'm now at Sato Heath. Sato Heath has two platforms and sees northern only services. So this is more like another station. Let's have a bit of a wander outside whilst I can. I've got half an hour. Oh no, there's grit, and I have a big, massive hatred for grit. Anyway, oh, there's one of them Amazon pickup things here. But anyway, let's have a look around Tato uh, Heath. When you're waiting for something, doesn't time go like really, really slow? It's like that right now. Because <laughs> there's not really to do, and I should have really done a backwards and forwards thing so I didn't have to like start, like sit down, waiting half an hour. Too late! <laughs> Too late. Um, I could do that at St. Helens Central if the train get there before the train back down so then I can get it like I don't know like where, where, where should I go and get it I'll have to look at RCT for that see what train like what station is like the closest for it probably Prescott no Pres. Uh, I don't know we'll have to find out in a second I'll speak to you in a second then okay so I just checked the time for the trains at St Helens the, the train back down to Lime Street is one of them ones from Blackburn North, so we'll not stop at all the stations. So we'll go up to Highton, but then I'll just miss a train to Wigan. So it's no point, so we're just going to have to wait half an hour. Okay, so now I'm getting on the next train, which is 531030. I will now see you at St. Helen Central. See you there. Just going to... 331-030 and now at St. Helens Central. Okay, so St. Helens Central has two platforms and it sees Northern and Trans Pennine services. Although the Trans Pennine services today are only one in one direct well, one in both directions, going towards Glasgow and towards Liverpool only today. So yeah, um first thing I noticed was this amazing station building. I really want to have a look outside of that, but literally it looks so good here. <laughs> um, so I think this might be my favourite station of today's vlog today, obviously. Um, but yeah, I just I just love the, the way that it feels so modernised. Like, I really want to say if this is what, what this would look like back before it was modernised. I wonder if I can. I don't know when it was mod like revamped but it definitely looks nice I could tell you that. A big part of me was wishing that this was the end of the vlog because I would love to finish it off right here you know because honestly building out here is absolutely stunning. Stunning out and it has the signs as well yeah. We've got loads of them big station signs here haven't we? Um, but yeah we're in St Helens now so take that off um, now what now we go back inside <laughs> so it looks like we've got a different train today <gasps> it's my favorite 323 232 <laughs> to end it off we're on a 323 oh it's 323 232 I'm so happy that's my favorite class
Okay, so I'm at the final station now. <laughs> I forgot what I was saying. Right, I'm, at, I'm now at Garswood. Just got off 33232, I just remembered. Um, so yeah, now I'm at Garswood. Garswood has two platforms and sees Northern only surfaces. And it is the last station of today. <laughs> Finally. <laughs> um, things have actually got warmer now as well, I've just realised. So that's even worse. Because <laughs> why couldn't it just be warmer at the start? Anyway. So now, yes, I said I'm at Goswood. <laughs> just have to double check on the... Um, <laughs> when I said I'm at Goswood. Because I thought I said Garston. For some reason, like, my head just thought, did I say Garston? So I just checked. Anyway, yeah. I said Goswood. <laughs> um, but yeah, I've just had a quick look outside because I've only got like 10 minutes here until I can go. But <laughs> I love the name of this road. Do you know what? Goswood is strange. But it's also on strange road, so it makes sense. Um, I love this. Uh, <laughs> and then there's even a railway pub right here. There's so many pubs next to a station called Railway, or the Railway. There's one in Waterloo, in Merseyside. There's one here, in Garswood, Merseyside. I wonder where else there's one in Merseyside called the Railway. It's probably a lot. And there's loads of roads, and, and yeah, there's loads of roads, or street names, or whatever, called Station Road, Station Avenue, something like that. And guess what? It's next to it, a station. Oh, look. There we go. Right. Um. Now what? Now I can go. <laughs> um, thank you guys for watching today's video. If you did, then just watch another one of my videos. Um, if you have any like suggestions on what I can do for future videos, because obviously Explore Mesa is just coming to an end soon, please do let me know in the comments. Um, say, say whatever you want in the comments and I will try and reply to you the best I can. Anyway, um, thank you again for watching today's video then. Um, I'll see you guys next time. Bye, guys. Funny thing about Eccleston Park as well, it's the little tiny dot matrixes. Those are so funny for me. I don't know why. Just <laughs> weird. This whole station's weird. What am I on about? <laughs> of course, I'm gonna have little teeny weeny dot matrixes here.